What's going on YouTube? It's Corey Daly, back with another video. I'm recording this intro the day before the event. Today is Friday, so that obviously means that the event is on a Saturday. I'm doing this intro right now, today, on a Friday, because I plan on getting up a little extra early. I didn't want to do it tomorrow because it might mess up like my time management as far as getting ready and getting to South Bay Galleria, which is where it's being held at. So. Uh, I just decided to just do it right here, right now. And that's that. So um, I'm gonna tap in with y'all in the morning and enjoy the video. Tomorrow. Well, since I'm body and beast, I keep my eyes in these streets. I hear the creep of your feet. That's why the ride in my reach. Don't take that leap of decease. I don't think to retreat. I'd rather die on my feet than not compete in these streets. I turn that cheek to a fleet. I fleece as your fleece. I don't speak to police. So it's now Saturday morning. Excuse the morning dust. I'm about to get right in a second. Other than that, I'm really looking forward to meeting Lonnie Walker. He had a really solid season with the Lakers. Very productive. And he remained professional throughout it all. Even he was cut out of the rotation. Um, he remained professional. He remained ready. And I respect him for that. He really came up big in that, uh, what was it, game? Six of the Western Conference Finals. Scored like 20 points in the fourth quarter, if I'm not wrong. So yeah, man, uh, I respect Lonnie Walker. I like his game, and I look forward to meeting him. I'm gonna wash my face and uh, brush my teeth. I'm gonna tap in with y'all. Give me one second. and teeth is now brush. Now it's time to get dressed. I'm gonna tap in with y'all when I finish getting dressed. Oh yeah, y'all, uh, I forgot to mention, Dylan, AKA Red Kicks, supposed to be coming through and supposed to be coming with me to the, the meet and greet. So I'm finna FaceTime him right now, see if he's even awake, see if he's still coming. Probably still asleep. All right, he didn't answer, so I'm assuming he's still asleep. Now, he's told me that he was going to be here around like seven ish and i check the time right now it is 6 34 so if dylan is still coming he is going to be running late but i'm honestly not surprised because dylan is the type of person to show up late to stuff, so I don't know. I'm finna get dressed though, and we'll see if he calls back or something, and we'll see what happens. All right, y'all, your boy is now dressed. You know what I'm saying, and the comments rate the fit. You know what I'm saying, got the striped casual shirt on, light blue jeans, the old school. Vans to match the shirt. Focus, focus. Yeah. You know, some light, some light, some light. But, anyways, uh, now that I'm dressed, I'm finna call Dylan again to see if he's up. Come again to see if he's up. Man, cause it's not looking, it's not looking too good as far as him coming with me. So, I'm finna call him again. And it's seven o'clock too. The time he said he'll be here. Ah. 
Well. Well. Looks like, I don't know. It ain't looking too good. It ain't, it ain't looking too good. Caught him once, didn't answer. Caught him again, didn't answer. So I don't know. I might be solo dolo this trip. Let's tap in with y'all when I get ready to leave. All right, y'all, so I'm about to get ready to head to South Bay Galleria. I just called Dylan like three times and he still didn't answer. So like I said, it looks like I'm gonna be solo dolo for this trip. And I was kind of hoping that he would come because I don't know how this is gonna work as far as uh, getting footage because I don't have a cameraman. So I don't know how this is going to work as far as getting footage and being able to to record the film. So like, I, I honestly don't know. You know if I'm obviously going to take a picture with him. So, I mean, if I don't get no footage, then, you know, I'll put some, I'll put the picture that we took. Other than that, I just got to hope for the best, you know. So, uh, I'm finna head there and I'ma tap in with y'all when I get there. All right, y'all, so just got to South Bay. It's currently, let's see, it is currently, it's currently 7.54. So we're on time. As far as getting here, I wanted to get here around eight o'clock. Wanted to make sure I get here around eight o'clock because the event starts at 12. It's only for one hour. And it's first come, first serve. I made it, I made it a priority to get here extra, extra early so I could somewhat beat the crowd. All right, so. I made it here. I don't know what I'm gonna do to pass the time. I will tap in with y'all when I get ready to go to go upstairs to the parking lot. All right, y'all, so I made the decision that I'm gonna go in a little early to the store. I'm supposed to be having a meet and greet at a store called Tick Time. I think that's what it's called. So I'm gonna go in there and see how it's looking to see if it's like a crowd or yet. Probably is gonna be a crowd, but uh, I'm gonna tap in with y'all when I get there. All right, y'all, so I'm here. I, it's only like two people. So it's still relatively kind of early. It's like eight, nine, and the meet and greet doesn't start till 12. I guess I'm gonna just wait here until Lonnie Walker gets here and just stay tuned. Yo, quick PSA. Shout out my dudes for holding the camera and getting the footage of me and Lonnie Walker. Um, the line wasn't that long. It was a. Uh, it was pretty smooth. I was third in line due to me coming four hours early, so that was pretty cool. Got in there quick, and uh, Dylan, you are a sellout. Get it together, my boy. Uh, hopefully, no more interruptions, and enjoy the video. Yes, sir. There he is. Yes, sir.
this video and I realized I didn't do an intro, so here it is. Um, this is gonna be a little recap of what happened yesterday. You know, it was a W day yesterday, very W day. Uh, as you can see, Lonnie Walker saw my basketball. See that, L4, number four. He got a cool little signature, you know what I'm saying? But, uh, so the original plan was to be mic'd up so y'all could hear me and Lonnie's conversation. But unfortunately, my roll mics was tripping. They were dead somehow, I don't know how. I think I just wasted my money on those, to be honest. Uh, so basically, he signed my basketball and then he asked me if I wanted to talk to him. And I was like, yeah, let me chop it up with you real quick. He was like, all right, talk to me. So, you know, I told him, that I appreciate him for what he did, what he did for the Lakers this season. I relayed a message that uh, my dad said that he would be happy to have him back on the Lakers. I, then I proceeded to tell him that me and him would love to have him back on the Lakers. And then, um, what did I say, what did I say? Um, then, oh wait, he said, after that, he said that, um, you know, he got to see what the Lakers is talking about. And I was like, yeah, you know, you got to do what's best for your career. You know, I understand. And then after that, I was like, you know, I make, I make content. I'm a YouTube, I'm a YouTuber and I create content. And I, it'll be dope if we could do some content, content together. And then he says that, he tells me that, um, to DM him. And when he said that, I'm like, okay, yeah, I'll DM you. But in my head, I'm like, I don't know. That's kind of a stretch, you know, cause, uh, DM that's there's a lot of people dming him so that that's that's a long shot right there like i just gotta get lucky so i ended up dm dming him anyway because you know uh you miss 100 percent of the shots that you don't take so you know why not and uh yeah that's pretty much it though uh lonnie he was cool you know what i'm saying real real respectful real cool See, um, now at the time of making this outro, um, I had found out earlier today that he signed with the Nets. So it was kind of a bummer, but at the same time, uh, I really, I really wasn't expecting him to sign back with the Lakers because, you know, he got cut out of the rotation and I'm sure he wants a, a certified role on the NBA team, you know? Even though he's not with us, I still wish him the best. You know, I like his game. Very athletic. Could shoot the ball, could put the ball on the floor. Got a little mid-range game. You know, so he's nice. But, uh, yeah, this is the end of this video. Um, I hope y'all enjoyed it. Um, I had a great time. It was a good day. I'm glad I went to that meet and greet. But other than that, like this video. Subscribe if you're new. And I'll catch y'all the next one. Stay safe. Peace.